All right, what up, everybody? Welcome back. We got a two-star Kabuko to start off this one. Nice. All right, we got a Kindred. Shen. Shen, Kogma, Kate. Okay, we got a Haunted House. Gain Aatrox or Shen. Cut Above. Cut Above is not really my favorite. Enter the Dragon, gain a Janna and Diana. Mm. Should I take low interest rates? You're capped at 3 gold. You get 2 gold at the start of player combat. Hmm. I do have like an Aphelios right? I actually have 3 faiths. Alright, let me level up. Oh wait. I just brought in three fates. I was gonna do uh like force fortune, but I don't know anymore. I think I might play a Felios. Cause I already have a Felios. It's been a long time. He's also exalted, so but then we need to no actually we can't play exalted. Okay, this guy's playing fortune. So once I beat this guy for sure. We could probably lost streak because this is probably the weakest guy in the lobby, but let's see what we get. So none of these are good for Ophelios, unfortunately. So we'll take the BB is good for Syndra, but we're probably going to take the tank item. I'm actually going to hammer this one though. Should I hammer the deep claw? Hmm. This place, this lobby kind of has some AP. I actually want to keep Deep Claw. Okay, bow is great. That was a good hammer. Okay, I'm going to move to the right. We have another Aphelios in the shop. And Yasuo. So, we're going to probably play like 5 baits minimum. And... Yeah, we'll see what happens. But we have Aphelios too already coming up. Bro, we're gonna make gold really fast through low interest interest rates, by the way. So you make a lot of money here. I'm gonna probably pre-level to five. So next item we want is another bow, probably. So for a Felios, ideally you want like three bows. Alright, so we're level five. We got a Zoe because it's champion delivery. So we can make up to 30 gold. Let's bring in. Two snipers, I guess. Oh, we got a Lux player. Yeah, I did scout this guy. He's got the boiling point. That one's really strong with Lux. This guy's gonna be pretty strong once he gets that Lux three up. He's gonna probably take some ashes as well. So the plan here is to go Ginsu and Crest of the Cinder for our boy Aphelios, because those items are good for him. Okay, Champion Delivery, give me a Thresh. Yes, Mr. Teapot. Okay, so we can level up to 6. Remember, I can only hold up to 30 gold, so I'm not making any more interest in that. Um, Kabuko, Kabuko. Actually, we should keep Kabuko. So Umbral Hex is on that side. Okay, so we're gonna keep up values here. Let's build Crest of the Cinder. So this is really good for Aphelios. He can proc the burn. He already has Sunder. You don't need Last Whisper. Ice for the crit. Ginsu's good. Runa, you can go Runans here as well. If you have Gold Collector, that's also fine. Gold Collector in this build is actually very strong. You can execute enemies fast. Okay, so right now I'm seeing zero Aphelios. Which is good for me. Then we will take Unified Resistance. Yeah, let's take that one. There's a Thresh. Let's go to level 7. We can do this. Level fast 7 here. Um, let's drop Kabuko now. Let's go for 5 baits. Riot. Nah, it's not really... Let's pair the Thresh and the Felios. 
Yeah, I mean, there's like guys playing Syndra and stuff, but there it doesn't look like he can play. He's not playing Aphelios with those kind of items. So five fates, you want to pair the Thresh and Aphelios together because they're the strongest combo. Or if you have Syndra, you can also pair th Syndra, but you always want to pair Thresh because Thresh is your tank and he, he cannot die. So, all right, we can make 20 gold here though. Let's do that. Not that awesome. There we go, two-star Aphelios. Thresh. So we'll hold at least 20 to 30 gold every round now. Alrighty. You can actually play Caitlyn here and Shen, by the ways. That extra ghost bonus can matter a little bit. There's a bit more damage. You do get the more tanky stats for Thresh when you have the Shen as well. Boxers are basically shorts. Let's get the Ash or Large Rod. Probably the Large Rod first. We want to get the Ginsu and then finish off the Aphelios. Alright, let's go Ginsu on the Aphelios. Make sure you guys always have Unify Resistance. Have at least three champions on the same row, or it does not work. Oh, I forgot about the Lux guy. We got to position better for this. Yeah, you never want to be on the opposite side of the Lux. Or the Lux will destroy your Aphelios. Yeah, we could have won this. That was my bad. Totally forgot about this guy. Okay, start Thresh. So we can actually start rolling now. Usually you roll, you roll at level 7. Like you could go level 8 and try to get a set too. I think that's also fine. But level 7 is where it's at. I'm probably gonna... I'm probably gonna end up dropping the Ghost for Ash. However... If you get an Orn, then you can put an Orn in Ash, and you drop the Caitlyn and Shen. But for now, we can keep the Ghost. We're not gonna bring in Porcelain, so we're not. We don't really care about Ash this game. She's just there as a trait. What's up, bro? What's up? What's up? What's up? Here we go. Always watch out for the Lux if you're fighting her, guys. Always watch out. All right, so we're going to now, hopefully we get a, yeah, Morgana is what I wanted. I'm gonna keep rolling. Yeah, there's definitely no Aphelios, just double checking though. You must buy all the Thresh and Aphelios. Yeah, so once again, we didn't see it. We don't have an Orn yet, so... I should bring in Syndra for two Arcanist. These items are not great. Um, we already have all the bows that we need, so getting more bows right now is bad. It's not good. We need more tank items. We don't need Last Whisper. We don't need another Crest, but I guess... If you have to build another red buff, that's better than... Actually, we, these items can be... Good on Ash, I suppose. Ash likes bows, but Uplink is good. Ghost is bad. Heavy hitters. This can be good if you three star. But Uplink is pretty good, I would say. Aphelius does have a huge mana cost. So let's take that. We'll want him to cast faster. It's weird. I'm seeing like a lot of Irelias right now. That's kind of weird, bro. Yeah, so Thresh will be a 3, but again, he doesn't have... My Guard Breaker is definitely good. I don't know if I want to do Guard Breaker, though. On Thresh. So it's good on a carry. Breaking Shields, are, it's, it's actually good because Yone is... You can see this guy, he always gets shields, so if you break the shield, he dies faster. So having a Guard Breaker is good. No, we don't need Sunfire Cape. We already have pressed. You don't build Sunfire, right? Here. There we go. We got the Orn. I'll bring an Orn and Ash. Yeah, our 
Velio's luck is not like insane or anything. Well, let me bring Kindred. I'll just do two Dryad, make Orn. Orn more tanky. Orn is gonna allow Thresh to survive longer, so that's good. Yeah, I think I will just do Last Whisper actually. And save this bow for another bow item. I got a tier. There we go. So Azir is gone. Here we'll drop Yasuo for Syndra for Arcanist again. Yeah. Up to roll a bit hard. Okay, we're very close. People are hitting their three stars. Where's mine? So you can go redemption. We have to put kindred on the top, or uh, Thresh doesn't get unified resistance. So this guy we can beat. So once Thresh has one more item, we're one Thresh away, one Aphelios away. So once we hit the threes, we start the Orn, we should be good. So we should have three star now. There we go. First one down. There we go. I'm gonna just probably sell the Yas. No point of having Yas unless you have seven fates. So next guy looks like it's going to be Lux. Which means we're going to put a Felius in the middle. Uh, Volley Bear, this guy is only a 2 star, so we should be fine. 6 Arcanist and 4 Porcelain. Yeah, that should be good, but you will need some emblems for that. This comp is now solid. Once you get a Felius and Thresh 3 at level 7, you're going to stabilize. Do we want this Syndra? I guess we do. Lock the shop. Yeah, I'm gonna remember the Lux guy. He's gonna be a uh, pain in the ass. All right, we got the uh, Syndra. Let's pick her up. Okay. So we can we can now make money. We hit our threes, stabilized. Uh, we got a Wukong, which is actually not that useful. So we do have a Ginsu, but we also do- I need to get Thresh another item. He's not done yet. So it's gonna have to be a uh, Crown Guard. Okay. So I just brought in Lux for Porcelain. Let's give this to Syndra. Yeah, so Thresh must have three items. He's your tank, and if he doesn't have three items, it's not gonna hold. So just give him any three tank items you can afford to give him. So we beat Kaisa. All right. And I'm gonna keep rolling until I hit my twos. Hmm. Okay. Once again, I'll just, I'm just going to keep a Felix in the middle until I fight the Lux, dude. The Lux guy is um, what I'm concerned about. This guy is really strong as well. Uh, ghosts are definitely not easy to beat. Oof. Yeah. Yeah, our positioning against ghosts wasn't good. Unfortunately. So I locked my shop. Azir. Did you get one set and Yasuo again? You're good. Somebody got that Soraka 3. There's a Yone 3 as well. Still not fighting the Lux, dude. I think, you know what? I may have to position against Yone. 
I'm gonna have to move my affiliates all the way onto the other side. Alright, so we can beat the Kaisas. Probably it's gonna be the Yon and the Lux that we haven't seen in a while. I'm gonna just take the Lux. Thieves look good, but I. No, not the Lux. I'm gonna take the Ash, just two star the Ash. IE is pretty good. She gets two items. We got two star Ash. And we got a set from Champion Delivery. That's actually good. Only thing is, you do need a Yas. Um, but we'll drop the Ari, I guess. We do that. So I think this is the best way we can position. Ah, uh, this is Soraka 3 and Yon 3. Yeah, this is good against... Uh, wait, the Yon is going for Aphelios. What the frick? I thought he wouldn't go for Aphelios. Okay. Ah, oh, I hate Yon so much. I was trying to position for Yon and Lux at the same time, but it didn't work out. Okay, we got our top four at least. Uh, we're actually gonna pair the set and Thresh now. Yep. Yeah. Cool. Okay, the next guy for sure is Lux. Okay, he moved his Lux. This is why I didn't put a Felios here. In the other side. It's always safest to put a Felios in the middle against Lux. Because uh, you don't know if he's going to move his Lux. This guy is a Mumu 3 and Nico 3 with 6 Arcanist. I think I can actually beat him, but yeah, I think I actually beat him here. Okay. So it's all about positioning. Keep your Aphelios in the middle. I think for Yon, actually, you have to... Stick to the plan. I think you have to actually like spray your guys out like this. Then he focuses the tanks, but... Or we put Aphelios in the middle. I think for Yon, you put Aphelios in the middle. Let's pop this open. Blue buff. That's good for Syndra, but... Syndra does have an item. I'm just thinking if I should give another item to, like, that. No, I think I'll just give it Syndra. I think every other item was trash on set, except for... I don't like Edge of Night on him. He's supposed to be uh, focused. I don't want him to be not focused. Yeah, I think this guy is really the easiest one. Unless he hits Kai'Sa 3, which I don't think he will. This guy. Okay, so we're getting at least second. I'm happy about that. Oh, there's the Yas. Only if I could level up. I think 7 Fate is better. Not enough money. I thought I had enough money to bring in Shen. I thought I had enough money to bring in Shen. Yeah, this guy's trying to kill my Aphelios so hard. So he put Aphelios in the middle and he'll focus the corners. He always goes to the furthest target. Okay, if I lose here, I am dead. Yeah. Okay, I got second. So honestly, seven fates is really good. Um, I would always push for seven fates if I can. So that's why I dropped the Orn 